Hello everybody, welcome back to Gaming with Garvin, <clears throat> Dale Ranch. Right now it is early spring, we finally added seasons on here. And I'm doing some tillage to work up some fields and stuff. I don't know what Xander's doing today. We haven't talked. So this, why seasons is on, we're going to try and make it more realistic. We're not going to talk to each other that much because he's so far away. And also this game keeps acting up and stuff but me and Xander bought some new equipment it obviously this isn't new but he bought a 8RT 410 two track tractor and a uh, Case IH Snyder quad track and then I bought a 8R 410 2020 series and an 8RX 410 so I bought those two because and then I returned the 9RT Wait is the DB90 still here? No, I don't I don't know if I have DB90 Yeah, okay, we still have the DB90 I was making sure we didn't not have it from last episode, or last time, <clears throat> that the game had an episode, dang. So we're going to be doing some tillage today, I think Xander, I don't know, guys up at town told me that he was going to try and plant some corn today. Our planting season is going to be in like late, late spring. So, yeah. So, we're just getting all the tillage done now. We're using the 8R because I don't trust the 8R410 with this because it keeps crashing my game. So, we're going to just use the 8R for now. So, we did get all harvest done. With the X9 and the Xander's Combine. We did not do Field 5. Which we have to go till up at some point. I gotta go do that. Probably in this episode once I get this field tilled. So what I'm gonna do with Field 5s is maybe divide it into two sections. One beans, one corn so where the five is in the middle of the field is I'm going to split that right there then the bigger side will be corn yeah yeah I know so at some point we got to go down to field five and go do some stuff I'm renting out a new area to Xander, the front part of field 2 is I'm now renting out the Xander, so that big front part where the waterway divides it by the road, so he's going to farm that. I don't think he's out there today, I think he's up by the barns today. But I'm doing tillage, I just got to till this up, and then I got to get the cultivator out here and start working it. We don't need the ripper uh, until fall, so the ripper is put away up in that barn. But we got to put it up in this one, so we have the space. The grain wagon is in this hay barn up here. Everything else has been put away. The 8RX and the 8R410 are in the shop. Or it's worms, and they're both plugged in. Because I know I'm going to use them. So what I'm hoping to do is get the 8RX on the planter and the 8R410 on probably more tillage maybe. <clears throat> but for now the 8400R will work. I already had this hooked up so I figured I'd just start doing some more with it. Oh, massive lag spike. Oh, 
โอเคอ l right, that's done for now. Cause the rest I'm just gonna cultivate. So <clears throat> now I'm going to go over to field five and start dividing it. Cause I want to get that done while I'm have this hooked up and everything. Cause I think I might put this plow on the back of the 410 8R. So you can see the 410's duels in the hitch right there. Actually, they're both in there. We gotta do tillage of that field, but I think I'm gonna get the big plow out to there. We gotta start doing tillage out there too. But I wanna go start doing field five since it's so far away. Looks like Xander got the old speed tilt out there. So we have about, uh, let's see, about 500 acres to do in total, probably. So we got a lot to do. That guy's field is very. Oh, weeds. Oh, there's Xander. I don't think he can hear that. So, we did uh, make another field last time me and him played. Uh, we made another field for me. It's over past the shop. You can see it. We made it with the rippers. Looks like Xander has a lot of planning to go through. I don't know when he's doing that front field. He said he'd do it at some point. I think his biggest field is field three that I'm renting out to him. So that's our my new field right there. I've only been down this way like one or two times to go get that 7 Series Combine and bring it back to the neighbor. So we're going to divide it right where the 5 is. So we got a long way to go. Field 6 has potatoes in it. Dang, I bet that's tough. bumpy roads back there here There we go. Now we need to unfold the plow and lower it and start tilling back here. Alright. There we go. We hire a worker to make the first straight row so I know where I'm going. So this side over here will be all corn and this side will be beans. This is a big field. So this field out here is about 
20 acres, I would say. Or actually, probably, it's actually way more if we were going by real life terms. It's about a 200 acre field in real life terms. But then again, this is farming simulator. There we go, we'll do this row back, and that's all I wanted to do with field 5. And then we'll start heading up to field 2 and start doing some tillage. Do you have your hazards on? How? What? Hmm. Uh, that's beacons. Hang on. R1? Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I know, but... Yeah, that's because you have, like, Model 6, I think. You don't have your beacons. That tractor can come with beacons. I was, I was so confused. I saw your beacons turn on. I'm like, what do you got over there, PC? Oh wow, there's the enter right there. Looks like Xander's gonna be planting corn today. I'm gonna start doing tillage.
I'll probably come over and visit him later when he's done planting. Yeah, it looks like he's about to go in full operation of tillage and planting. He's got a little bit of tillage left to do out there. Yeah, so we're going to start doing tillage on field two. We're going to go out by the house, though. It is early spring, but there is a good chance of cold weather, and I want to get the field two done. Or actually... Actually, I want to do field one first. I forgot I didn't have this half done. So we're going to do this half first. Alright, let's see. Do I have to have this raised up for a worker? What is this? Oh, that makes no sense. So we did not do all tillage, not fall, fall, not fall, all tillage, and last time we played it. So, but in the, since we have seasons now, now we're going to do uh, seasons, uh, with the seasons we're going to do uh, fall tillage.
I'm sorry. I'm sorry, sir. <laughs> yeah, uh, just put it up in the farmyard. I'll get put away later. I've actually gotten a decent bit done in this little short time frame, dang. Goodwill Plow. I think Xander's planting all day, I don't know. He's got that tillage to do, and I think that's all the tillage he has to do. I have to do this field, a little bit of that field over there, and that field. And field five, and we'll be done. The tillage. Which should take all spring, so. Yeah. It's a very nice spring day. It's cold. It's 37 degrees. It'll be warming up though. That little center uh, silver point in the middle of a stock row, and then I get straight up with the rows. I think I got the depth pretty good. I need to lower the depth in the field too though. Cause it's more compact and crap and I gotta work it down. So that's all till it. All I gotta do is just work it under with the cultivator and the disc, which I'll probably go over to Xander's and borrow that big cultivator he's got, the Tiger Mate, because I don't have a deep till cultivator. I just have plows and a disc, which is the storm, which I need to actually use. We'll probably use the storm a lot in the fall, though. So what we gonna do in the summer because we don't have any crops for the summer except if we had wheat. Uh, we have a lot of grass and waterways and stuff so we're gonna uh, make hay out of it. Which all I need really is a bush hog, a windrower, and a baler. I sold the old baler because we didn't think we were gonna use it.
So, uh, me and my grandpa on the real farm, farming with Garvin, uh, we used to just chisel plow right in the beginning of spring. That's all we used to do until we did start doing fall tillage. And that is way better than trying to do it in spring. But we're going to get some fall tillage in this year. I might get to do it. I might not. You never know. That unfolds so slow. Yeah, it, do it does look nice. Oh, is the 7,000 not working well? Is that a 1720 or is that a bigger one? Oh, okay. So it's not a 1720, it's a 1725. How much does it hold? You use like six pallets. The DM90 doesn't even hold that much. Holy crap! The DB90 holds It should. The quad track has 535. You're good. Mm, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, if I had that, I wouldn't use it on the quad track. It just looks weird. Especially how it's going to turn. What's the other tractor? You only have two big tractors, right? It's the RT and that. Yeah, I saw I saw it.
Look how much I've gotten done. Yeah, I, I just started like 10 minutes ago. That's a uh, 12 row, you said? Yeah, mine's bigger. <laughs> yeah, no kidding, mine's a 36 row. I don't think he will, especially with that quad chat on there. I think you should put Enderos on that field before you just hire it out. They can probably do that back little circle corner. You gotta put n -res on it. I, I forgot that big old hole is still out there. Yeah, the one where we flipped the tractor in. We we'll almost flipped the tractor. It just got stuck. Oh, is that? It was actually this exact same setup. Good thing I got it tilled though. That was a sneeze. You went. <gasps> it was a. It was a. A snuff. Yeah, probably when I start doing Field 5, I'll probably have you out there too, so I'm not spending like six episodes out there. This, this equal till is really working though, I like it. Okay, I just lowered the plow and I missed one stalk. Like, look at that. Okay, I'm gonna do this quick strip over here that I left. Oh, that waterway is actually really slippery for some reason. Well, we haven't had rain, so that, that means it has been slippery. I am getting a lot of dirt on my tractor though, so that it is pretty wet out. But we can do tillage, right? It's wet. It's just not too wet.
If you guys are wondering why this cultivation strip is out here, it's from the 2730 Ripper. Because uh, it's got a disc on the back of it. We'll save the game just in case if it crashes. Yeah, I don't think it will anymore. Yeah, Planter's doing fine. This is doing fine so far. Yeah, also guys, we bought this in the process too. Because we didn't show it off yet. So I'm going to put the speed tail in the barn at this. You haven't used the speed tail on the quad track, did you? Okay. I was wondering because uh, the couplers on here are different. The hydraulic ones, it's a good John Deere to case. I've had it on the John Deere, so. There we go. There's our new 8R410 and 8RX in there. Alright. I think I'm gonna just put the tractor in. I can't put the chisel in. Luckily, this tractor's warm. I bet you those IHs won't start, though. Them internationals in there. There we go. I know it won't fit, guys. I'm not going to shut the doors. Oh yeah, let's have a look at the new tractors. So here's the 410 8R. Pretty nice. It might be probably probably a tillage tractor. This will most likely be planting tractor. Got the old truck back here. I gotta turn off the lights. So here's all of our tillage equipment. It's stored in here. There's some of it up there and up in that barn. So we'll go up in this barn and show you guys because I don't think you've seen this barn that much. So I built this just for the X9 but it was bigger for the X9 so I just stuck the 7R trike in here. The X9 1100 and the header for it and the Apache truck. And the DB90 which we have to get out probably next episode. And I put the 9R in there. So I'll shut that. I did two fields today and one percent of one. So next thing I think is we'll get the storm out. The storm and probably the speed to them put them on the 8RX and the 9R and start disking up some ground. So that'll be all for this episode. Hope y'all have a Great day, and I guess I'll see you later.